What up, Tube? Coming to you live from the Westgate Smoky Mountain Resort and Spa. Been staying here for a few days. Thought I'd go ahead and do a vlog and show you the tour of the wonderful facilities down here, right in between Pigeon Forge and Gatlinburg. It's technically Gatlinburg, but it's in between the two. Uh, a lot of great things here, a lot of great uh, things to do on the property, as well as uh, Charlie will take you into town. I'll show you the water park and show you the room and some of the other stuff here in town. So, or I'm sorry, here at the resort. So, uh, follow me, will you? guys so this is the outside of our unit as you can see 21c and 21b is ours uh, i'll show you where the 21b door is uh, these are lockouts and i'll show you why uh, it's a different layout last year i was up there and they're the 500s they have a different layout i like this layout a lot better it's a lot more roomy and a lot more private when you have your room so let's go ahead and check it out <laughs> all right so first thing when you come in is you're going to have a common area which means that this door and this door are like would be locked so that way if somebody had that room like that's 21b and that's 21c so if you had you know basically only one apartment or one cabin you would have that but since there's four of us and the people that we're with had the timeshare here uh, that we have both of these. They have a three bedroom, but they just rented out the third and we took the two. So this would be the main bigger uh, one and I'll show you ours, which is still pretty big, but um, I'll show you both of them. So ours has everything that, that theirs does. Uh, here's the living room, kitchen, full kitchen, and they have everything you want in there, including bowls, uh, spoons, plates, all that stuff, for refrigerator. Uh, that folds out to a bed, 
50 inch screen TV. And then it has a big balcony. We've actually got a bigger balcony than they do. They were jealous because uh, our balcony actually runs all the way the length of our apartment. So um, we were just right over there where I was showing you. And then this is our view from our balcony. The, uh, the other balcony has a really awesome view, but this is still nice, especially in the morning. So if you come back in here, like I said, it's a different layout than some of the others. You come in here, and here's the bedroom. The bedroom's really awesome. Uh, another 50-inch screen TV, and uh, they have great uh, internet. I got 90 meg download when I checked it, so I brought my Fire Stick. The Fire Stick works great there. Uh, they have the open uh, cable access right there to hook up your HDMI and plug it in. Uh, king size bed. Sorry, it's messy, but you know we've been here a day already. Um, basically, two lamps each side, and each lamp has. Uh, its own plug-in and has a USB plug-in so like I have my tablet in that USB but I have my fast charge plugged in there and my computer plugged in there I always bring a power strip wherever I go when I travel you guys probably notice that if you see any of my videos um, this door here is the other side of the um, the uh, balcony I was just at so, so we got two two sides of the balcony there. One straight from the bedroom, one straight to the uh, the kitchen. We get this situated here. I'll take care of it later. All right. So we we'll turn the light on here. We got a full closet here. Lots of closet space. Uh, safe right there. Lots of closet space. Uh, Linens and uh, stuff for the high or the yeah the hideaway bed there, so pretty good closet. And this is why they call them a lockout because each of them lock out. So like the third bedroom I was telling you about, if we were all three here, this is the common area for that. So basically, it's a mirror image of what we were on the other side. So you got 21 A, B, and C. So I've not seen what 21A looks like, but I'm assuming it might be like 21C. If not, it might be like this. Oh, bathroom, really nice bathroom. This bathroom is different than the other, and I'll show you why here. Hey guys, it's got a jetted tub, which the other one uh, I, that I had up, up there at about 500s didn't. And the other tub that they have in there is, you'll see, I'll show you that. But this makes it nice, especially for me with a bad back and the bad knees and everything. I love that. Rainfall shower there, shower there, pretty cool. Um, dual vanities makes it nice. And then a separate place for the bathroom. So if you're in the shower, you get there. And then this just leads you right out back into the living room. Like I said, TV, couches, kitchen, everything. So now I'm gonna take you to 21C, which is where our friends are staying that own the timeshare. So you walk in here, to your left, you got their bathroom, but this is just a bathroom for like guests. So it's just got a sink, toilet, stand up shower, sit down, it's got rain shower and all that stuff. So this is a, this is like a half bath or maybe you'd call it, I guess. Um, it's really nice, but you'll see why they have just the stand up shower here. So, we come in here, as you see it's a little bit bigger, there's a 50 inch screen TV there, balcony there, same kind of setup, in a fireplace though, um, and then you got uh, the couches and everything here, big dining room, that's where we all hang out, then a bigger kitchen with a bar uh, sitting here, um, you got all the snacks and stuff, they got all the cabinets full of everything. Uh, them being here, of course, to keep trash and mops and ironing boards and everything. And they supply it everything, so if you need anything, you can just dial a number and they'll bring you, you know, anything you need that they stock, which is, you know, trash bags, spoons, bowls, pouts, pans, uh, all kinds of stuff. So here's why they have a shower. This is the master bedroom for them. Same thing, king size bed, big king size bed, another 50 inch screen TV same thing with the uh, 
uh, lamps there, the barrel lamps. That's why they have the stand-up shower, or the stand-up shower, because they got a really, really deep kind of a spa hot tub thing going on there. Really nice. Um, some of the other ones that I've been in have uh, pillars here, like a Roman style, like a pillar. So that's the one I was in last year, and they got the big closet here, and then they've got their uh, um, stuff here, and then they've also got another shower right there. So it's really convenient when you have a lot of people because there's so much stuff and that leads out to a balcony and then this here leads out to a balcony this balcony isn't near as big it's uh, a lot a lot smaller than the one I showed you up front there there's that door I didn't show you but look at the view that they got the uh, the beautiful view of the uh, woods and everything and it's recovering really good from the fire. You can still see up there uh, where the fire took a lot of trees. We actually saw a bear along that path up there a little bit ago and he went in the brush. It was pretty cool. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much the gist of the layout of this um, exact floor plan. Like I said, there's all kinds of different ones, but this is the floor plan for, for this timeshare and this building.